everybody thinks that San Francisco is a hippy dippy kind of place. Anything goes and pretty much totally permissive. But San Francisco is now considering a new law that will protect the pedestrians who are using crosswalks in the city streets. And Los Angeles probably won't do it. Hello, I'm Eli Castronova. I'm an injury attorney in Southern California, protecting the rights of pedestrians who are injured in auto accidents. In Los Angeles, the love of the car is so pervasive that they don't want to restrict anything. They want to go as fast as they can. They want to make turns uh, on any color light, regardless of safety. But in San Francisco, they are considering passing an ordinance that will prevent drivers from turning right on red lights in intersections. Now, why is this an important thing? Well, in the United States, over 7,000 pedestrians uh, are killed each year due to auto accidents. And in Los Angeles, uh, that death rate has gone up 20% year after year. Many of these injuries and deaths are caused when drivers turn right on red lights. Why is this? Because when a driver is stopped at an intersection preparing to turn right, their attention is distracted from the crosswalks. They frequently look to their right because they're beginning their turn and they don't notice pedestrians that are approaching from their left. Also, often they're looking to their left and not looking to their right as they're turning right and pedestrians are approaching from their right. So this is a very dangerous situation and it's a very common situation. I remember when I was young in Burbank here in, in Southern California, they did not allow turns on red lights, uh, but that has gone by the wayside because of the Los Angeles car culture. In San Francisco, they hope to prevent more deaths and serious injuries from right turns on red lights. Obviously, when you're turning right on a green light, pedestrians are on notice, and so you have less accidents. This is something that has uh, gained traction in San Francisco because of the recent death of a baby in a stroller when a driver was turning right on a red light. And it's unfortunate that it takes a death for something to motivate uh, people to, to make necessary changes for public safety. The only other city in the United States which prevents right turns on red lights is New York City. I don't think that Los Angeles will ever change this law because we don't really want to restrict the freedom of drivers. So when a client comes into my office and they've been injured by a person who turns right on a red light, I know we've got a clear case of fault because regardless of the color of the light, the driver has to look out for pedestrians and the safety of pedestrians are tantamount especially now that the state passed the law last year that pedestrians have the right of way even when they're walking across the light as long as it's safe to do so. So I think that it's something that should be considered by the Los Angeles City Council. Hopefully it will, but I give kudos to the Council of uh, San Francisco for uh, considering passing this ordinance and I think they will and I think it's necessary if you're injured in an accident in which somebody turns right against a red light and hits you, give me a call. We've represented hundreds of clients in accidents just like this, and we have the experience to recover for you against the insurance companies. Hi there. I am an AI avatar reading a real Google review by Amanda Ferrer. After our family got into an accident caused by a drunk driver, attorney Eli Castronova and his office helped us get through that terrible time. They were very informative and worked quickly with all parties for resolution. 
Attorney Castronova was great working with my son and daughter. He was easy to talk with and treated us with kindness and respect throughout the entire process. We would definitely recommend him. Thanks for your review, Amanda Ferrer. It's appreciated. Elliot Castronova is an excellent attorney who truly has his client's best interest at heart. He is easy to talk to and made me feel comfortable from the start. He clearly explained the legal process for my case. I appreciated that he kept me updated through emails and phone calls. He fought hard and negotiated a settlement that I'm extremely pleased with. Thanks for your review, Chris Jacobi. It's appreciated. Eli J. Castronova is an excellent wrongful death lawyer. He is very professional and dedicated to his clients. He has a great success rate and is very knowledgeable about the law. Thanks for your review, Amina Bolem. It's appreciated. Elia and his team are knowledgeable and experienced, and they're also very friendly and easy to work with. Mr. Castronova was nothing less than a blessing. Going to court in pain is stressful beyond belief. But not only did he ensure I was comfortable, he did everything in his power to fight for my case. Best attorney around. Hands down. Thanks for your review, Lionel Coleman. It's appreciated.